Welcome to the Lucy fan family, all the way down from Canaby up towards McCroom Way. It's great to have you in today and just to have a chat to you about um, the Farming Family Award, which was a new award category that we launched for the West Cork Farming Awards this year. And just before we kick off, I'd just like to say a big thank you to our overall Farming Awards sponsor, which is IFAC. And I'd also like to say a thank you to Cultivate Credit Union Farm Finance, uh, who are the sponsors of the Farm Family Award. And I'm delighted that we have a couple of representatives uh, from Bantry Credit Union, Finbar Roche, and from Access Credit Union, Dominic Casey, here with us today. So, that's all the formalities out of the way. The first thing I'm going to say is, well, first of all, thank you for sending in your video. It was absolutely brilliant. Who, who, who was involved in, in making the video? Or, who, or whose idea was the video to start with? Yeah, yeah. I suppose I saw, I saw it advertised on Facebook and... I, you know, I saw the categories and things, and then when I saw the farming family, I said, "Oh my God, that could, you know, that, could that, be. that that's us." I suppose we just we love farming, and yeah. it, it's uh, we myself and my husband built on the family farm, and my brother built across the way, and I suppose we just love getting together. We love going down home to mom and dad, and we love being around doing the jobs, yeah. and it's only a small farm. But we just love being together and we love all the work. Any job that's there, you have plenty of volunteers. For them, <laughs> yes. Just, yes. <laughs> and I think that really came out in the yeah. video. You could see the uh, the sort of the, 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 the fun that you had. Yeah. And, and, yeah. Um, I mean, would you would you would you kids would you would you would you class it as fun working on the farm? Yeah. Yeah. yeah? You you enjoy it? Yeah. yeah. And any of you thinking of becoming a farmer when you grow up? Yeah. Are you? Okay. And uh, it's Adam, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. And, and that's something you fancy doing for a, for a job in the future, Adam, is it? Yeah. Yeah, very good. And and Sheila and Jared, do you think, will he make a good farmer? I think he would, yes. Yeah? Yeah. Well, there you go. Yeah. We've, got, we've got the stamp of approval <laughs> from people. Yeah. He's extremely helpful. He's on hand every morning during his holidays. And every Saturday morning, he's down Fantastic. to do the jobs. Brings a cup of coffee before him for men. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's the most, impo well that's the most important thing, isn't it? Yeah. 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 Um, and Sheila and Jared, you, 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 would have, you would have set up the farm originally, don't you? Yes, yes. Several, yes, several decades right, yeah. now. Yes, um, we came from a farming background. Jared came from Kendry, I came from Bantry from a farming background as well. Fantastic. So yeah. it's, in, it's in your blood. Yes. Left, right? this yes. Is your, so you must feel particularly proud to see not just your children who have grown up children, but your grandchildren. And, and they've got a grandchild on the way, is that right? Did That's that correct, yes. right. Uh, it but, gives but, us great pleasure to see them being interested in all and coming down to us and all of this to smash it. Yeah, having a bit, having, and having a bit of fun along yes. the way. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So what's, I'm going to ask the children again, what, what, what's your favourite job on the farm? Or what, what time, of, what part of the year might be the favourite job? Do you have a favourite? Uh, I, I like to go with the calves, like the, like mm -hmm. in the winter and the summer, like when we have the calves, in the autumn. I'd like the feeding the calves and looking after the calves. Yeah, with the new the new season, the new the new life coming, the calves, yeah. etc., etc. Very good. Anyone else? I like it in the summer when we can do bailing. Fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> and, and why why would that be? So we can do bits. What climbing up and jumping off and yeah. all, that, yeah. all that kind of stuff is it? Yeah, yeah. And running yeah. around and throwing the sausage uh, yeah. <laughs> bit of <laughs> <Mary Kiki. laughs> And let yeah. me ask you this, what would be the least favourite job? What's the job when you get asked to do it, you go, oh, God. Oh, you know, what, what, what? Stop picking the stones. <laughs> <laughs> you don't like that at all, man. No, 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 very, very good. So, um, will you all be working on the farm this weekend that the job's lined up to do? Yeah. 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 There's always something. There's always something. Exactly, I think yeah. every yeah. farm would say that. Yeah. They're... They're bottle feeding some twin calves at the minute, so wow, that's been being done. And I'd say Nan has a bit of poor washing done over yes. the weekend. As well. <laughs> I'm getting the impression here, Nan, that you have the, There's list, always of, a plan. the, the list of jobs. <laughs> <laughs> Who's available? Do you have a, do you have a, a clipboard? Yes. Or you, you do. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me also. I mean, do, do, I presume it, it can be helpful. Do 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 you, do you manage to get a holiday? So because you've got Help. Would you get away at all for a we break? Do, we do, from yeah. Peace, I mean. yeah. Everything is looked after when we're away. And that must be fantastic yeah, because yeah. we know that's very important in farming families' lives these days, where it's some like farmers the, don't get the chance. They don't get the chance to get away. Yeah. We're lucky that way, you know, they take care of things when we're away. 
That's really important, isn't she's it? She's yeah. going to break. Yeah, she's still. Yeah. There's nearly a fight over the jobs, actually, between Garrow Gar- Gar- <laughs> does his does jobs before work then, and the dogs are minded, and the cows are checked, and <laughs> everyone loves to be involved, and reports are made back then during the day, <laughs> if there's anything you miss. <laughs> And would you guys ever bring some of your friends from school or your, your pals? Would they, would they would you ever bring them down to the farm at all? Or are they interested in it? Or? Oh, yeah. yeah. Sometimes. Yeah, bring yeah. them down the field and stuff. Yeah, yeah, which, which for yeah. people who maybe aren't from a farming background, they, they probably enjoy and, and, and get stuck in. Great. Well, that, look, that's fantastic, isn't it? It's great, it's great to have you today. It's great to see the, 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 the camaraderie and the family nature of, of, of what you do. You can tell it, just you're all very enthusiastic yeah. about it. And, and obviously we're only talking to hear what, a fraction of the group. A fraction of the group. <laughs> because, because ordinarily there might be another, what, 10 or ten or so of you, I think, is it? Is that right? Is um, adding everybody up? Or? Yeah, there'd be another eight, just eight, eight. between Gerald and Jean. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, so my brother, my brother and his wife uh-huh. and their little boy would be down every every Saturday morning then as well to they do, do all the heavy jobs. All the Gar- yeah, yeah. Carol would. Yeah. And um even their little boy, he's two and she he's mad for moving the cows as well. He's always on hand in his trike or Brilliant. with a stick around the place with his mom <laughs> and they're always Everyone gets, everyone gets, there's a gap for everyone to stand in. There's always a gap for everyone to stand in their life. <laughs> That's what my grandma told me. <laughs> and when's, when's the, the new baby grandchild due? Uh, this first of November. Oh, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Do you have a little pair of wellies waiting? <laughs> yes, <laughs> ready waiting. <laughs> And you're, mo- you're mostly um, uh, pedigree herd. Pedigree herd, like yeah. Would that be correct? Yeah. Herefords. Yeah. Herefords. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And what kind of size herd would be? Well, we have only 15 cows. That can okay. Be. Yeah. And we breed after them then and sell the bulls. And oh, I see. Keep up great new herd, you know. Keep, keep the quality. Yeah. Keep the yeah. quality, yeah. yeah. Get yeah. rid of plenty. Fantastic. That's, that's uh, nervous or anything like that, you know? Sure. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, Keeping I see. the best. Yeah. Yeah. Sounds fantastic. We hope. We hope. <laughs> well, listen, it's fantastic, as I said, to have you down. Obviously, what we what we wanted to do today was just to meet you, just to have this kind of chat, get it on film a little bit, so that right. um, we could take it back and maybe just show 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 the judges, and it will just help them to make their final decision. Um, but actually, we maybe have got you down here on slightly false pretenses today because we showed your video to all the judges. Yes. And down to a man and down to a woman. They thought your video, and even when they see this video now of you chatting, I know that I can tell you categorically that they think there's only one winner of this year's inaugural, the first time we've ever done the West Cork Farming Family Award. And that winner is the Lucy family. <laughs> I'm sorry if we slightly misled you, but we thought it'd be quite good fun yeah. to get you down and, and have the chat and then tell you the good news. Oh, really? Yeah. Yes. And very well deserved. Very yeah. well deserved. Thank and you. What, we, what, what, what I'm going to... Actually, what I'm going to ask now is I'm going to ask Dominic and Finbo if they wouldn't mind just stepping over and uh, presenting you with your prize, which you may remember the prize is... Uh, we call it the West Court Prize. So it's... Um, it's a, it's a meal for the family at uh, the Celtic Ross Hotel. Now, you might need to speak to the general manager about how many people can go to that. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. Um, it's, we'll all, it up. it's a family pass to the lagoon in, in Ross Carberry. Um, help me out here, guys. It's a family pass to the, um, uh, cinema. Uh, to the cinema in Clonakilty, the park cinema in Clonakilty. And it's a family pass to the smugglers go Woo-hoo! in Ross Carberry. <laughs> <laughs> So thank you to all of those local businesses, the Celtic Ross, uh, Smugglers Cove, the Lagoon, and the Clonakilty Park Hotel Cinema uh, for providing those prizes. We're very appreciative of that. Very well deserved. Thank you.